I can assure you, this is no joke. Coffee flavoured bacon. What the fuck? Right then. Coffee flavoured bacon. £1.79 from Aldi. Seven rashes. Looks a little bit fatty. Let's see what active ingredients are in this. Pork 87%, water, salt, flavouring, stabiliser, triop to, sounds like a fucking dinosaur, antioxidant, sodium aspirate, preservatives, potassium nitrate and sodium nitrate. No hint of coffee. Um, right, seven unsmoked coffee flavour back bacon rashes with added water. What could possibly go wrong? Right, well, I usually microwave the out bacon, but today I'm going to grill it. Don't know why, just decided to grill this one. Take that off. See all the crap that's in it. 22% salt, 1% sugar, 12% saturates, 10% fat, 5% energy. Don't need that. So I'm cutting this up in there. Fatty for my liking, like, but yeah, pure coffee that one. You will have to excuse me, I have got a cat on my back. Oh, get off you! Can't have none of this. It's coffee, you want coffee? Yeah. You don't want that, do you? Right, let's get this grill fired up. And as always, before preparing food, especially bacon or fresh meat, wash your mitts or you will get this. I would like to just take a moment to introduce Gray. Lovely little 11, 12 week old kitten. Very inquisitive, very playful, and very funny. Seven pieces of coffee flavoured bacon now awaiting their fate without this little one. You won't like it. Come on, get off it. Hey. You won't like coffee flavoured bacon. Right, see you guys in a bit. Well, one thing I can confirm is halfway through, all I can smell is bacon, pork. No hint of coffee whatsoever. It's both at all in the taste. Right then. Here we go. A bit greasy, but... Right, I'm a bit unsure what to do with it. I've buttered two rounds of bread. See if I can do a little butty. Um, I'm going to taste one piece on its own just for now. To see what, you know, if the coffee's there. I'm going to be honest, there's no coffee taste there, really. I was thinking, what goes with coffee, apart from bacon? Um, I know. Cream. Coffees and cream. Only a little bit, because it's not mine. Here we go. There. Do you know what? Not actually that bad. On hand is me Jag Fanta from Aldi. Orange by Vive. Wash that down. Cheers. Right, on to the sandwich. I'm 
shall put some bacon on my sandwich. I shall have three, no salt because it's full of salt already. Tomato ketchup, let's have a bit of that. Happy days, hold you over. Tastes like bacon. I can confirm there is no taste of pepper pig anywhere. Maybe if you do microwave it, it might retain its taste, but I think grilling it takes the taste away, burns it off. The initial smell when you open it is indeed coffee. No. I think you haven't cloned at the market anywhere there Aldi. A, I don't think anyone's going to go for this, and B, who sat in your boardroom, around a table, in a meeting, and said, I reckon we should do coffee flavour bacon. Oh. In all honesty, I don't think it's going to catch on. It just tastes like normal bacon. And I'm going to do the last two pieces just to confirm. Smell. Grilled bacon. Taste. Grilled bacon. Smell. Grilled bacon. And taste. Oops. Grilled bacon and tomato sauce. Yep, that's it. Well, well, well. When I started doing these food videos, I never thought I'd end up doing a video on coffee flavoured bacon. Is it worth getting? No. Is it just a gimmick? Unfortunately it is. It doesn't taste anything like coffee when you cook it. it smells originally like coffee when you open it, but you know, general taste to it. Nah, it's not for me that, I'm afraid. Cheers for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. So will this one as well, I think. Cheers.